Hello friends, this video on 3 dimensional geometry part 7 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 6. Let's take one example. It says that we need to find the Cartesian equation of the line which passes through this and parallel to this. So till now what we have done, we have some point here. Let's suppose minus 2, 4 and minus 5 this is a vector. And this pass, this is parallel to some L vector. But in this case, instead of L vector, I know that equation of the line is of this form. x plus 3 by 3, y minus 4 by 5, z plus 3 by 6. And this is some lambda we know. So if you can convert this guy into my L vector form, then I can solve the question. Because till now I know that r vector is nothing but a plus lambda into L vector, correct? And I can convert this guy, this guy in the L vector form, my problem is solved. So do that. Please note here we are interested in L vector. We are not interested in the equation of this line, right? This is the equation of the line. From this equation, we will find the L vector. So if you note know this, this equation is nothing but, this is nothing but equation of line passing through x plus 3 so minus 3 y minus 4 so plus 4 z plus 8 minus 8 so it passes through this and parallel to some vector l that is 3i 5j 6k 3i plus 5j plus 6k correct that means this equation this is equation of this line L is this that means this denotes a line equation which passes through point this and parallel to some L vector and this L vector will be 3i plus 5j plus 6k. Please note when I am saying that I have x plus 3 by 3 is equal to y minus 4 by 5 is equal to z plus 8 by 6 this is nothing but a equation of line that passes through minus 3 4 and 8 and is parallel to 3i plus 5j plus 60. That is clear. Now, if my this means that my L vector is 3a plus 5j plus 6. Correct? Why? See, this whole thing denotes some equation of line that is parallel to this L vector and passes through this one. I am interested only in L vector. So I got this L vector from this equation. This is the equation of line and this is just L vector and I am looking only for L vector. Right. So now I have A vector, I have L vector. So my equation of line is very simple. R is equal to A vector plus lambda L vector. A vector is given that is minus 2i 4j minus 5k. Right. This point. So I will say minus 2i plus 4j cap minus 5k cap plus some lambda into L vector. L vector is this one, we found this. 3i cap plus 5g cap plus 6k cap. Correct. And this is equal to what? Minus 2i plus 3 lambda, sorry, minus 2 plus 3 lambda i cap plus 4 plus 5 lambda j cap plus plus minus 5 plus 6 lambda. So this is my equation of line which passes through point this and parallel to this. The same equation I can write in this fashion also x plus 2 by 3 is equal to y minus 4 by 5 is equal to z minus minus 5 is z plus 5 by 6. How I wrote this? See I use the right method. You can use a conventional method also where you can say that this guy is xi plus yj plus zk. Correct. Then you compare these guys, you get lambdas and you create, you'll get the same answer actually. I'm using a shortcut where I know that if I have equation of this fashion x minus x1 by a is equal to y minus y1 by b is equal to z minus z1 by c, this is the equation of the line 
which passes through x1, y1, z1. Here x1, y1, z1 is minus 2 plus 4 minus 1. Minus 2 plus 4 minus 5. So this is minus 2, this is plus 4, and this is minus 5. Right? And that is parallel to a vector ABC, and this guy is ABC here in this case. So this guy is 3, 5, and 6. So directly I have used this formula to get this equation. If you don't know the formula directly, if you don't want to use the formula, then you can use the normal method. Here I have got this one, and this I can say is nothing but xi plus yj plus zk because it's a variable thing, right? Any any b point in this line, right? X, y, z. And you equate these two guys. For example, you say that minus 2 plus 3 lambda is equal to x, or you say, uh, uh, or you say x lambda is equal to x plus 2 by 3. Similarly, you say 4 plus 5 lambda is equal to y, or you say lambda is equal to y minus 4 by 5, or you say here minus 5 plus 6 lambda is equal to z, or you say lambda is equal to z plus 5 by 6. And all of lambda, so you can say that x plus 2 by 3, that is this guy, is equal to y minus 4 by 5 is equal to this guy, is equal to z plus 5 by 6. So you got this equation. So you can use any of these, you can directly use the formula or you can use the normal leverage which I have used in most of the questions. And that's how you get the solution. So the catch here was we were given an equation of the line for this. From this equation of the line, we found the line vector. Please note equation of the line is different from line vector. So this was the equation of the line in Cartesian form. So with this we found the line vector because we are interested only in the line vector L here, right? We are not interested in the equation of this line. We are interested in the, in the line vector of this line because we are saying that the final equation which we get for this line is a vector plus lambda into line vector of this. Let's take one more example. We have to find the Cartesian equation of this line the Cartesian equation is this, we have to find a vector form. This is pretty simple. This denotes, this denotes line passing through x minus 5, so this is 5, y minus minus 4, so it is minus 4, z minus 6, 6, We're passing through this and parallel to 3i plus 7j plus 2. 3i 7j plus 2. Why? Because we know that if the line is of this form x minus x1 by a is equal to y minus y1 by b is equal to z minus z1 by c. That means the line passes through x1, y1, z1 and it is parallel to a, b, c. That's how it is. Right? We know this. We compared this guy with this guy. We found that x1 was 5, y1 was minus 4, and z1 is 6. Now, if this is, I know that there's a line that passes through this and parallel to this. So, this is my, you can say, a vector. a vector is 5i minus 4j plus 6k. And this guy is l vector, 3i plus 7j plus 2k. Same thing I have, this is my a vector I have and some l vector I have. So this is, I have to find an equation that line passes through this a vector and parallel to this. So let assume that this line is lambda l vector. So my equation of the line will be r vector, right? Because r can be any point in this line, right? So this r vector is nothing but a vector plus lambda l vector. A vector is this guy, 5i minus 4j plus 6k is my a vector plus lambda into L vector, this guy, 372, 3i plus 7j plus 2k, right? So with this, I get 5 plus 3 lambda, i plus minus 4 plus 7 lambda j plus 6 plus 2 lambda, 2 lambda here. This is my equation of the same line in vector form. Very easy, not a difficult thing. So the Cartesian form was given from this. 
we found a vector form. Similarly, if my vector form is given, I can find a Cartesian form also. Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors, and much more. Thanks once again.